Hello again geeks, I am that gamer guy and this week we're discussing bisexuality. So the 23rd of September is Bisexuality Awareness Day. And as somebody that identifies as bisexual, I feel it's my responsibility to bring awareness to this awareness. Despite the fact that I've never had a relationship with a woman, nor have I had intimate relations for a number of years now, I still find women sexually attractive and I still identify as bisexual. Now some people that watch this will choose to accept that, but there will be others that don't. And that's because there's a seemingly increasing mentality that bisexuality is a myth. For some reason, many people choose to dismiss bisexuality, and this seemingly applies more to bisexual men than it does to bisexual women. Most straight women regard bisexual men as basically gay. A mentality that I can somewhat understand, it still disregards my attraction to an entire gender, but I can somewhat understand it. And on the other side of the spectrum, gay men regard bisexual men as halfway out of the closet. And in my opinion, this is because many gay men use bisexuality as a stepping stone in the coming out process. And in my experience, most, I hate the term but we're going to use it, biphobia tends to come from gay men who you would assume have experienced ignorance in their own lives. <coughs> Christopher Wiggins. Consequently, it is unbelievably frustrating to have your sexuality disregarded by colleagues and even friends and family, but it's something that you get used to. Now, despite all this, there is also the stigma of bisexual people that we are greedy, I love that one, and that we are more likely to be unfaithful. Firstly, I'm not greedy, I didn't choose to find both genders attractive, and secondly, there is no correlation whatsoever between bisexuality and unfaithfulness. Just because I find both genders appealing, doesn't mean I'm more likely to be unfaithful. Great people can cheat, gay people can cheat, bisexual people can cheat. Sexuality doesn't matter. If you're gonna cheat, you're gonna cheat. And one last thing, I was recently asked that because I'm bisexual, do I find feminine men attractive and masculine women attractive? And for me, personally, no. But I think a fair number of bisexual people would agree with me that I like my men to be men and my women to be women. Just because I'm bisexual doesn't mean I want an amalgamation of both in one person. And so if you watching are one of those people that have made judgments on bisexuality in the past, then hopefully this video has taught you something. And if there's one thing that I want you to take away from this video, it's that bisexuality isn't a myth. Okay, those are my thoughts on the matter. Please feel free to leave your thoughts down in the comments. And with that, I'll say goodbye. Please like and subscribe if you want to see more. I also write a bi-weekly gaming blog and have a separate gaming channel, which I'll leave links to down below. And if there's anything gaming, geek or LGBT that you'd like me to discuss in a future video, then please leave your suggestion down in the comments. And as ever, I hope to see you guys next time, but until then... I think the worst type, though, is, I'm afraid to say, the bisexuals. I think the worst type, though, is, I'm afraid to say, the bisexuals. What it is, is people not wanting to admit they're gay.